Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of The Hoedown. I'm going to get that up, because it's, it's, it's nice. Uh, it's not. Today we have got a slightly different video, but not really. Um, some of you may stop looking at me and putting pressure on what I'm saying. Some of you maybe have watched them, some of you probably have seen them on TikTok. We saw them on TikTok, they're on YouTube also. They do podcasts together. They're called Jamo and Dylan, and they're these two Australian boys that um, basically, they talk about a lot of things, but part... Some of the things they do in stop fucking looking at me like that, mate. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Not look at you. Come yeah, on, not I'm, look I'm, at me. How hard is it not to stare at that guy? They do shower thoughts and kind of what we do. Something. And they have people like calling in and stuff. Basically, we couldn't be bothered to find our own shower thoughts today. And <laughs> we actually like what they're. We yeah, like their shower it's thoughts. It's not seeing their TikToks gradually, like on our for you page and stuff, influenced. Yeah. us quite a bit in the idea that we could just sort of sit and chat which is like what we like doing and then we were like oh these guys are doing this and they're funny and entertaining and a lot of the work is done in the shower thought itself anyway so you know easy, easy. what are you saying yeah. you're, so, <laughs> you're not making sense why am I not making sense you're putting words together that seems like it should be making sense but it's not well it was making you. sense you just couldn't follow me so yeah today we're going to put up some of their TikToks about here and you uh, can watch you more, can... more about there and um we're gonna talk about them basically stealing some of their thoughts obviously if you're not go and subscribe to the channel their link will be in the description great moustaches as well great time how do you say moustache i hate they're decent hate compared saying. to ours they're better well you didn't say they're not good then they're very <laughs> good compared to us but they're they're decent i was thinking actually we could have drawn some more for today's video um, um yeah hope you enjoy if you like this please like share comment subscribe and make sure you check them out if i take it down would you really hold me down i'd be your best friend Okay, this first one for you. This is a toilet paper scam, which I was telling you about ages ago. Yeah. For me, it's interesting. Okay. I found something out about toilet paper. Now, you see the design on it, the flowers? Yes. yes. How the flowers are upright. So, when you have the toilet roll on the wall, let's say this is the wall, you'd have it like that, right? Yes. But that's how you and I have yes. toilet rolls. Yes. It rolls like this down, and then you pull. A lot of people do it the other way and have it like that. You pull it down like that, you use less toilet paper because with the rolling technique, right, when you pull it down like that, a lot more comes down in yes. comparison to the other way. But apparently, years ago, toilet paper manufacturers designed it so the designs are that way. So if you put it on like we do, the conventional way, you pull more than you should. Right? So you buy more toilet paper. So you paper. buy more toilet paper. Whereas if it's the other way, People go, oh, no, it's on the wrong way because, look, the design's on the oh, back. I like that. That's a toilet paper company hack. It is. We've just exposed the... F That's mad, isn't it? It's... But... Wait. I you... liked it, mate. Okay. <laughs> I knew you, I knew you were going to have shit to say about that. I honestly knew I you I liked it. Firstly, I actually like hearing Australian accents. So, I like hearing these lads talk. Secondly... <laughs> Let's take that out. No, we won't. Because no, you've gone red. <laughs> Secondly, do you pull toilet paper by time? One Mississippi, two Mississippi break. Like, I do it by squares. So if it was the other way around, I would still take four squares. Fold, fold. So you've got four quadruple. And, and likewise. Yeah. Okay, this brings me on to a related point. A lot of people don't fold. Okay, well, hold on. Save that thought. We'll go on to that. Because... Firstly, do you do it by time or do you do it by squares? Oscar, nobody on the planet does it by time. Well, there you go. No, so that isn't the No, no, it's not what you're saying. It's here, right? Fuck, I need to talk. Okay, it's here. Pull. Yeah. And it snaps. Yeah. When you do that, more will come off and it dangles down more. This is how I would do it. Four, still quite strong. Okay, so I get break another four. Fold, fold. Oh, it's weaker now. Break two. Two. Fold, fold. So I've got a thin four thickness. Yes, then Oscar. two. So I don't want numbers of squares. Of people don't fold though. If you scrunch, okay, but if no you one, no one just swipes one, do they? No, but that's the point. No one's ever, ever wiping with just one piece of paper, mate. That's why you honestly may as well just use your hand. Anyway, what I'm saying, Oscar, is that the quantity isn't thought out. Are you gonna fucking listen to me? The number of sheets isn't thought out by a lot of people. You might need it meticulously, but sometimes I'll go for four and end up only ripping three. And then you have to get a single one and put it in. <laughs> put it in. So exactly, it's on. Yeah, but I I fold. Guess what percent of women scrunch? Eighty-five. Well, that's fucking ridiculous, isn't it? Say shit like that. 
52% of women and 38% of men. Are they talking about wiping ass? <laughs> They're talking about wiping ass. Very bizarre way to phrase it. How would you have done it? Wiping butt. But then this stat says only 15% of people do it. I can't it? back a scrunch yes. If you break four off and scrunch and do it, there's no way of reusing that. Whereas if I break four off, fold, boom, I can then fold it and in half. After first wipe though. <laughs> you what don't fold. <laughs> Okay, regardless, regardless, what's your opinion on the toilet paper companies forcing that upon the consumer? I, Clever. So I think it goes that way anyway, though. Do you know what I mean? So Not you don't have it scraping against the wall. Oh, he's on something there, actually. What if the wall's dirty? Yeah, exactly. In, in, in like a public toilet. Yeah, you, you don't away it. from the wall. Yeah, but it's wiping shit. Your shit's your own, dirty. Yeah, it's your own shit, though. I think it doesn't actually matter. Okay, next one. This is actually the first one I ever saw of theirs. No way. The How first can you ever. say no way. Back in a bus mm. with two rows of, of two. Yep. An aisle down the middle fit in the same lane as just a normal car. And when you think about it, it's weird. It is weird what they can make fit in the same space. It is. You can walk on a bus freely. In the same lane. Two people can sit comfortably. Then you can have two people standing in a lane. Then two people sitting comfortably again. Yeah. Come on. And it fits in the same. It's literally... Whoever's the bus maker, just explain. Um, that is brilliant. Yeah, I've never seen that. I'm actually finding that very funny. I sent that into my group chat. And then I just thought for a moment, and it's because no cars don't take up the whole lane. No, but well, you say do. that though. But if a if like a big Land Rover was going down the middle lane, yeah, is it, it's not edge to edge. It's not edge to edge for sure. There's definitely space either side of the car. Oh, more than that. Yes, more than that, but I'm talking if if this, if this was a car. That was a car. If that was a car. Well, that's but already got three, three maybe four. Please shut the fuck up whilst I explain it. Like <laughs> There's definitely gaps either side. Yeah. It's still mad for there to be that much extra. Much no, extra. so if you think about it, you only need enough for a seat and two people. Two, two, two. Yeah. And there's three seats in a big car. Yeah. So you need enough for another seat and two people to stand. Which is a fucking lot of space. Not really. My explanation to it is that bus walls are, must be thin. Yeah, I think he's onto something there. Well, a car door is about this thick. Look, a car door and a bus wall is not enough to make a f***ing difference. Two car doors, Oscar. Boom, boom. Whereas a bus wall is probably about this thick all the way through. No way is it that thin. I honestly think it is. They, the walls look thin on a bus. They do. Car walls. Well, half of it's just window, isn't it? That's like that thick. That's not what I'm referring to, Oscar. Could be. It's not what I'm referring to. I'm referring to... I guess I just think that that's a funny thought and then funny thought until you break it down But the thing about shower thoughts is that they're easily broken down, but it's this is what I keep trying to remind you Let it yeah, so let, it, take... let it impress me got another I've got one more. Do you want another? Though? Yeah, we've got we time could... for another. Yeah, I know I'm asking do you want a fourth one? Yeah, we've got time for one more and one more, please. I think this is actually a thinker. I wonder why childbirth has to be such an unpleasant experience Maybe you're not meant to have kids if it's so fucking painful. Yeah, maybe that's a thing. Why couldn't it have just been like... Pleasant. Just out, just comes out walking, happy, like there's no pain. I feel like it'd be pretty cool if, you know, like you put the little babies in water and then they grow. Not mm. like a real baby. Oh, I know what you're talking yeah, about. Like like it, you could put even like dinosaurs and shit. Grow and, a girlfriend, grow a boyfriend, yeah. those type of things. That'd All be right. a more organic way. And like you go, you like they just take a bit from you. Like yeah. they take a blood test from you and your missus, mm -hmm. put it together. They give you your little water baby. Yeah. You put it in and it grows. Oh. Um, yeah. I liked it, and now I thought of an explanation instantly. God, <laughs> um, there is an explanation for it, in my opinion. Wait, let me let me let it, let me soak it in a second. Now, let me think of something to say also, because it's a very fair point. It's like poisonous food; it's bad for you. It like makes you ill, so then you learn not to have it. Whereas like childbirth, you can even die. Loads of people would have died in the uh, in the past. Okay, continue. Well, I've got the explanation. I'm just letting you soak it in. I'm, I'm feeding you. I'm feeding you stuff. No, okay. You were... That, okay. Um, pointing out the obvious there. Okay. That's what I'm saying. I was trying to help you along. I knew, I could have think of that myself, mate. Um, okay. I'm more thinking about this water growing scenario. Okay, well, that's the second bit of it. Let's go bit by bit. Okay. Okay, so I think the explanation for it being unpleasant is because, you know, the creator... Evolution. If everybody could freely have babies, it would actually f*** the planet, wouldn't it? Easy birth stuff, anybody can have it. To have something which is super difficult to get, it ensures that the people going for it should really want it. No. So, so if you're willing no. if you're willing to go through all the shit stuff... That is, this is the no, poorest oh, oh, argument oh, oh, you've oh, ever given. Hold on. If you're willing to go through the shit stuff, 
then it might mean that you, you'd be more suited no. for, for motherhood. It's probably not to do with who's best suited, but it's more to do with survival of the fittest. Well, that is who's best suited. Yeah, but you made it sound like someone's, this is a thought out plan. Isn't I said creator evolution? Yeah, but no, no, that. It, it, this, is, this is only the strongest can have offspring. That's just, actually, that's it. It's just, you have to go through a bit of pain to get the flower. And what did your wonderful mind have to say about the... About Wait, the hold mother, on, maybe? hold on. We're still talking about that. That survival of the fittest is why childbirth hurts. I suppose that would be it, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, makes sense, doesn't it? What did you want to have to say about the growing your baby? Not possible. <laughs> and that's what we've got to say about that. Well, I suppose it's IVF, really, isn't it? No, because that's still then whacked in someone, isn't it? Test, you can't have test tube babies. In vitro so. fertilization, so that it's only once board, that's happened. Board, 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 board. You can't have test tube babies, can't you? Oh, they're not fucking grown in a test tube, though. It's the fertilization, are, and then it's and then it's put inside a womb. What do you think? What do you think? Like Rick and Morty, just grown in a fucking test tube. I did put, put in the microwave for twenty minutes. I did. I did. You didn't. Think I that. did think that they could be grown. That's why I thought the whole load of moral issues with it. Like you can't go a kid in a lab. You physically can't grow, grow kids. Well, you probably f could. You probably f couldn't. I don't think you could. All you have to do is imitate a womb and okay, feed it. You might be able to. An incubator. In which case, why don't they? Why haven't well, they? That's what I mean. The moral issues. There's no it. moral issue. Well, it is. It wouldn't wouldn't really have a mum. Well, the the or scientist. It. Yeah, exactly. But the other thing is that you could just fucking put any genetic you want into it. Well, you couldn't. You'd still have to have one sperm, one egg. Just one pump cell in, of semen. Can you not just pump in like alleles? No. Well, you probably could, but not... Yeah, exactly. Not. Well, designer babies. Exactly. This, oh, this is what I'm saying. This is why I think they don't do it. They can do well, it. Well, yeah, but they could do it ethically where they just use a natural sperm, natural egg. The yeah, mum just waits for it. The they don't have to... Yeah, they could. Maybe. I don't know enough science about it. Do you? No, but that's what I'm saying. It could be possible. We actually don't know... If so this started off you saying that it's impossible, and now... You, you said it's impossible. No, I said growing a baby in water would oh, be yeah. impossible. Impossible. Babies are in liquid, aren't they? Ambiotic fluid. Ambiotic sac. Fluid. S contained. Encased in the sac. Yeah. Placenta. Hmm. I think we've discovered a lot more things than we were expecting to today. Yeah, that actually did lead on to a lot more And I think we're going to have to go and do a bit more research before we start talking about that again. Don't. That would happen. Take our word for it. It might be able to happen. Can happen. Should happen. Shouldn't happen, but it can happen. Why it, shouldn't it happen? The second someone starts doing that, UK starts doing it, America's like, they're grown. They're grown superhumans. They're gonna have no, not superhumans. I'm talking about just. I'm just talking. With I know Oscar, like, but it means if they start, it means they have the capability of growing yeah, they, superhumans. They, but they might already have the capability. Means no, no, no. But I'm soldiers, not talking about superhumans. Super I'm soldiers, talking about one sperm, one egg. And then all the all the all the oh, all the unions and the lands. I'm talking about one sperm, one egg. Natural. They do that. They don't do that. Yeah, and I'll tell you why they don't do it. Imagine if a lab. No, 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 you're no. Being really fucking annoying. No, 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 no. I, uh, this is going back to it. If some lab in America starts growing a kid, right? Regardless of pumping it with whatever genetics. Yeah. People around the world are like, fuck, they could all of a sudden grow 50 no, kids all in one go. No, because they, they could detonate nukes to, to kill the whole oh, planet. That is no, actually a perfect oh, example, oh, thank oh, you. Stop fucking pointing your thank finger you. at me and let me speak, you I had to take it then, didn't you? No, 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 please, please, before you open your Okay. Hi, Oscar. You, you, I don't know why you're suddenly taking it to superhumans and all these powers around the world. So you didn't That's just good. listen to everything I said. No, because you're going, oh no, because it's, it's not doing that. Firstly, yourself. calm down. Secondly, I literally said, even if they don't pump it with genetics yeah. in one year, and they have you a full also army. birth 50 in one year, using up their womb space. Well, no, no, and I'm because saying. You really don't understand. No, I do, mate, and I'm saying that they can't do that because if they start doing that, it becomes a threat. Oh, Luca. Oh. <laughs> oh, please let me speak. Nico, right now you can clone sh actually. They cloned a fucking sheep ages ago. So, so imagine what it's like now. Suddenly create armies of superpowers. This I'm talking about is technology to help parents who can't host a child. Who's fucking paying? Luca, I'm not. Luca, are you, are you trying no. to piss me off? No, no. Uh, okay. I'm Do you done understand? Talking, I understand what you're saying, but I'm saying that when you start going in to certain certain territories, because the world is ba a bad place. The world, well, someone's got a crazy IVF facility is a thing. now. IVF is the thing. Luca, oh, okay. In okay. addition, in addition. Stop saying in addition, please. You're being horrible, mate. Oscar, you've got worked up and you've let your emotions get the better of you. But in addition to this, all this shit might already be happening. We actually have no idea what's going on. <laughs> to be honest. Anyway. Thanks for tuning in. Big thanks to Jam and Dylan for that. Don't forget to check them out and make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, what are you fucking looking at?
Oh, scary! I don't know what you were so caught up on superhumans. I wasn't talk. I was talking about help. I did, I, an army. did I not stop talking about superhumans early on? God, like I said, don't pump it. Thank you very much for tuning in. Um, with the Ho Twins. <sighs> Peace and love. Arrivederci. Mwah. If you liked it, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe. We post Monday to Friday. We're doing a. What day is it today? What, Thursday. Mic's off. Why? Because we're done. I just said Arrivederci. Are you serious? What a weird thing to do mid sentence. I just said Arrivederci. Right. It's not off, it's not off, it's not off. If I take you down, would you really hold me down and be your best friend?